So when last we left, we have a lot of questions for Bastula. Like, hey, what the frick? Also, it's cheating to use the the idea that I was nearly brain dead to wipe my memories, to wipe what was left of my memories and rebuild me from scratch, implementing or whatever, imp yeah, implementing, I don't know, sticking other memories in my head is so morally disgusting. Okay. Um. Oh, I can go across this? Oh, dang. I thought this was actually an open pit. On it. Damn. Oh, yeah, that's what I thought. We can't chase him. Oh, dang. Do I have to do this on my own? She was totally shocked. Yeah. Lucky her. Now, oh, that's really... That's awesome. Like, legitimately. It would be... It would be so fun to see. Uh... On it. Damn! Okay. There's all these doors that don't do anything. This one? <gasps> Malik, I'm coming for you. Or Malik? Yeah. Revan, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. So he locked the one door, but there's like a roundabout? What? <laughs> oh, Malik, Malik, Malik. This is why you're never going to be a Sith Lord. On it. Damn. I'm just gonna circle my way back. Yep. All right. Well. Okay. I just want. I just wanted to open all the doors I could open. Okay. 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 That's. This way. Oh, dang it. On it. Damn. All right. Well, then. I guess there's an, an, a, another way. Further behind me. Okay. I assume I have to unlock the hangar door and hangar control. But it's been like a like I don't know, not a week, even like a three days since I've played. So I don't remember. I think I just booked it down here anyway. That's right, because like okay, I remember because I came in from the elevator and I thought this looked like the main area. Like like I was gonna come in and and when I was walking down the hallway I saw that it was red down here. But I thought this was going to be like a dead end because the map looks like it's centralizing something over here. So I was like, okay, if there's any big showdown, it's going to be over here. <laughs> Not over here. I'll just go check this dead end out <laughs> and then go over here. And that is not what happened. Not what happened at all. Oh, no. Am I stuck in here? <gasps> On it. Oh, no. Okay, never mind. Everything's been changed. I have no idea what to do. Oh, jeez. And it was revealed that Revan's injuries when he was captured destroyed her mind. It was implied that restoring Revan to what she was before was impossible. Oh, okay. Well, when I when I did it, it did say, like, it did say that my, basically, it, it sounded like I was brain dead, essentially. Um, but they were still hoping... That I was gonna like be useful and that my latent memories were gonna come to the surface and that's why they kept me around. I don't know what to do. Did I like miss out on like a whole area? I'm so sad. Oh man, that's what I get. Yeah, um, I don't, I don't see anything. I'm probably gonna look it up I what what wait 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 the whole time I was clicking the lock key 
thing because it was like, oh, it's locked. You have to unlock it. All I had to do was touch the door? I, most players including... Okay, apparently, yeah. I mean, I did... Okay, I figured it out right before you told me, but like, or I just decided on like a whim to touch the door. But oh my gosh, what the heck? That was so dumb. I'm so angry. Okay, now I feel bad because I thought Malik had just run off, and at the end, so sorry, you two. I thought that Malik had run off and that that was the end and I was gonna end that episode there with this huge talk about like the reveal or whatever and the whole time Revan's just been sitting there with his arms crossed tapping his toes waiting for me to come across <laughs> okay I am gonna use oh can I not oh okay, okay. force resistant haha Oh wait, actually, I will hit him once, but I do want to use... Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my gosh, stupid... I'm glad I wasn't in the middle of something. Stupid friggin' pop-ups. Yeah, you do! You get the exclusive experience for this part. It's all for you, except you and YouTube, who will probably watch this. <laughs> But you get the exclusive live viewing experience. I know I start. I didn't. I didn't announce a stream today. So. <gasps> okay. Yeah. We'll do that. Wait. What? <laughs> ow! 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 Okay. That worked. Oh, dang. Um, so good. I just gotta heal every so often. Oh, dang. Okay, never mind. Okay. Oh my gosh! Oh, but This isn't over, Oh, man. Your friends do not give up easily. Oh, this is all... Boop, 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 boop. You always could inspire loyalty. But even the three of you together cannot stand against my power. For the Jedi! It sounds like, um... I'll hold Malak off. You two get out of here. Find the Star Forge. Wait, no, I don't have. No, Bastila, he's too strong. Wait, what? No! <sighs> <sighs> the door's sealed. We can't get past. Come on, we have to get to the Ebon Hawk. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Oh, she's gonna like hold him off and we're gonna leave the ship? It's not like, oh, let's look for the Star Forge on the ship, but we have to go finish getting the map pieces and then come back? Oh my gosh, Bastille has just sacrificed herself. Oh my gosh. Hi, Grammy. <laughs> Welcome. Oh, we have to help her. Bastila doesn't stand a chance against Malak, but we can't help her. Not here. We have to get off the ship and find the Star Forge. That's the key to being oh, the Dark Oh no! Bastila sacrifice. No! We can't let her sacrifice be in vain. Come on! Oh my gosh! That was intense. Also, Bastila, you should be very well able to take care of him because he's at half health right now. He's, he's at like a third health. Oh my gosh. Well, hang on. Let's see if I can... He was at, like, he was so low. Nope. <laughs> They're not gonna let me do it this time. I know! Karth is just like, we can't help her, and she stands no chance. And I'm like, wait a second, bro! Like, what? Like, Bastula's, like, one of the most powerful Jedi right now. Wait. There was actually, like, a whole other area I didn't look at. Can I, I know this is, this is so not in keeping with the story, running around and going to look. It's probably locked, but man, I'll, I freaking, I should not have gone towards the red lights. I know, right? The only thing I, preventing us from ending the game right now is a door. Damn. Yeah, okay, all right. Gamer fast car, you're very right. <laughs> it's true. Like, seriously. 
<laughs> like that was the easiest, probably one of the easiest fights I've had, honestly, is up against Malik. Like the fight that came before this with like three Jedi and like four Arbalists and freaking a zillion other things was way more difficult. Oh, let's hope the cutscenes don't, uh, story waits on loot. Well, the story just poop, pooped on loot just now. Come back. Okay. Pew, 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 You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. See how easy it'll be when you face him again? That feels ominous. That feels somewhat ominous. Hey, we didn't we didn't drop the stream on the trend on the on the transition there. There's still time yet though. Oh, did we get shot? <gasps> We're being followed! Do not, please don't make me fly, 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 I don't want to do it, I don't want to do it. Come back, stream, or I'll, I'm gonna cry. Okay, oh no! No, no, please don't, no, don't make me do this. I don't want to do this. Uh, where, where the frig are you? You're going under my ship, I can't, okay, wow, you exploded like on me. Uh, oh, I can like turn all the way around. Where'd you? What? It's so hard to see. I can't see anything. Why isn't this working? There we go. This is so hard. I can look in a bazillion other, I can look in like full 360 degrees and up above me, but I can't. Uh oh, did I blow up? Oh my gosh. Oh, I did it. <gasps> did I do it? Oh my gosh, we were, we were at critical there. I didn't realize there was a radar. We're out, homies. Bastila, your sacrifice. We'll come get you, don't worry. I'm sure she's fine. Where is Bastila? What happened on that? We had to go we ran into rescue her you earlier. Us, but Bastila sacrificed herself. No, I would have killed him! She's dead? Ah, Malik won't kill her. Don't be foolish. He'll want to use her battle meditation against the Republic. Turn her to the dark side, and the Sith will always be victorious. Oh, dang. Not so fast. We've got a bigger issue to deal with here. They deserve to know the Oh, day. Oh! Do you want to tell them what Malik said? Or should Oh, I? calm down, Karn. Uh, I don't care what Malik said. I'm not Darth Revan. I'm Brinkar or... Okay, I'll do... We, we know it's probably true. I know, right? Droid-operated turrets like everybody else. Really? The first time you played with you five times mostly because the cinematic transition made the game wonky? Yeah, I don't know. That was weird. I'm Darth Revan. I'm, I can't even say that out loud. It's so weird. Oh my gosh. Revan? What, what are you talking They're not going to believe me. Is this some kind of a joke? No, it's no joke. The Jedi Council captured Revan and erased the Dark Lord's mind, programming in a new identity. Saul Karath told me on the Leviathan. And Bastila confirmed it. You're Darth Revan? This is... This is big. Do you... Do you remember anything about being the Dark Lord? Uh, small bits, a few strange dreams and visions, that's all. Just a few flashes. That's it. Nothing more? Then I don't think there's I mean, Darth Revan was Seems nice at first. If you don't really remember anything about being Revan, then it doesn't really matter anymore. You are who you are now, 
right? Of course it's still there. Yeah, shut up, Karth. How do we know more memories won't come flooding back? How do we know Revan won't suddenly turn on us? The whole time we've been chasing after Malak, we've had his old Sith master right at our side, listening to our secrets. I mean, he's not wrong. We're going full Sith now then, obviously. Yeah, right. <laughs> it's like, okay, time to be full Sith. Right, like at the beginning, Revan had good intentions. Like, the whole point in going out in, on that whole, like, expedition out into, like, deep space or whatever was to, like, try to find, like, a solution for the war, you know? Like, it was like Revan got, like, corrupted by, like, it wasn't even just, like, maybe, like, insidious whispers or whatever. It feels like the dark side actually, like, physically corrupted her almost, you know? Um, uh, oh, interesting. An extended universe lore? Weird. Um, I'm sorry, Karth. I wish this wasn't true. Hey, you've got nothing to be sorry about. You didn't ask for this. Besides, I know you. You're not Revan anymore. Whatever you used to be- I have fake memories. <laughs> like, how does that even, like- my existential crisis must be, must be outside the roof, out the roof, whatever. Big Z and I will stick by you. We owe you our lives. We won't desert you now. How can you say that, Mission? The Sith bombed my homeworld. Revan took away my family and destroyed no, my life. No, Revan didn't Everyone do that personally. Who gave the order to attack your people, Carl. Ooh. You can't blame Revan for that. Thank you. I suppose you've proven yourself to be a friend of the Republic by your actions so far, Revan. But can I trust you? Any of us. Don't, don't call me Revan. Also, I'm I actually because of the, the way I usually read chat is I read from the bottom up for whatever reason. So the first thing I saw was Grammy, don't spoil the old republic. So I'm not looking at whatever Grammy wrote. So there, <laughs> it's lucky that I read chat backwards because I'm a weirdo. <laughs> Just ever type a bunch of stuff, quick. Type type a bunch of things. Pew 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 pew. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Romeo. <laughs> Perfect. Yay! It's gone. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. Karth. Okay. To be fair. To be fair. Karth has fair reasons for not trusting me, but he can't really blame me. I, I didn't, Revan didn't personally come down and murder his family. He just finished killing Saul for that, even though Saul didn't actually go down there and personally murder his family. It was like a consequence of the decisions made and a big part of consequence of the decisions Revan made, you know? But yeah, it wasn't like I personally went down there and murdered his family, you know? Also, Candorous having my back just, like, makes me so happy. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> uh, what about you, Joey? What about me? I already knew What? You, though it wasn't my place to tell you. What? Better off that you know if you have oh, to change what? anything. I'm not here to judge you. You do what, what you have to do, and I'll help if I can. What? What? Did every single freaking Jedi that I ran into... No. Also, is my voice too loud? Should I like? I'm gonna push my microphone away. I'm gonna push my microphone away a little bit because I'm a little bit like ah. That still doesn't do anything. It still looks like it's really loud. I'm gonna turn it just 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 a teensy weetsy bit down. Just a teensy weetsy bit down. Um. But yeah. I like did all the Jedi like read my mind and see like the weird gaps in there and like the implanted memories like can you imagine having fake it's like a Blade Runner you know I guess well I, maybe no, maybe someone hasn't seen it I don't want to spoil Blade Runner but I only just recently saw it like last month the first time I ever saw it it was one of those ones that I was like I gotta get my I gotta get my nerd cred up you know watch Blade Runner so I did, but it has like a, it has a character who has to deal with that. It doesn't it doesn't explore it very much, but you know it explores it a little bit. 
The Jed well yeah, the Jedi on Dantooine know, but apparently Joe Lee also knew. And Joe Lee has been in exile, like self imposed exile, for freaking like twenty years or something. Like but he somehow knew unless Bastard like confided to him. Also, where's Juhani? What like where's Juhani on this? Did I, where, like, because she's a Jedi, too. You won't abandon me, will you, T3, the little robot that I've only brought out, like, twice? What do you think, Kandras? You defeated the Mandalore clans in the war. Oh, my gosh, that's right. You're the only one in the galaxy who could best <gasps> We have never met one like you before, and never since. How can you even ask if I'll follow you? Whatever you're fighting, it will be worthy of my skill. I'm your man until the end, Revan. No how oh my gosh! <laughs> we get all butterflies. <laughs> Not being able to romance Candorous is the hill I will die on that I'm sad about. <laughs> it's the sad hill I'll die on. <laughs> but wow, no, this actually, like, I hadn't even thought about it, but this puts into perspective, like, all those times that like, Candorous was like, Revan was a tactical genius, or blah, blah, blah. Like, okay. I mean, like, I seriously have, like, avoided, be like, thinking about this a lot, like, for, like, this, ever since I was spoiled, and, like, there are still some things that I'm gonna go back and look at and be like, oh my gosh, like, whoa, and, like, the whole time I've been here, like, asking Candorous stories about his war experiences, and, like, half of them were against me, apparently, and I'm like, wait, whoa, <laughs> what? <laughs> it's kind of crazy. What do you, HK doesn't care. <laughs> What? Experiencing something unusual, Master. <gasps> oh my gosh! Was I HK's previous owner? Is that what it is? Is, it, is his final memories being unlocked? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! told to me from like my friends I'm like wait a second like that was me but then also like as Bryn like how would I feel because like I don't feel like like I lost a lot of those memories as Revan like I am not Revan anymore this, like at all you know I don't I probably don't have like the exact same like skills and like like memories and like lessons learned from like past memories and stuff so like it's a lot to live up to too affirmation Correct, Master. Sith protocols maintain that all droid knowledge be deleted before assassination missions and restored upon return. Mm. I have returned to you, and my full functionality is now under your personal command. It is wow. a pleasure to see you again, Master. <laughs> so that makes a lot of sense, <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want to say that, but I also want to say I'm not exactly Revan anymore. Uh, <laughs> I do, I do. Say, well, that makes a lot of sense, actually. <laughs> Observation. Indeed, I do hope we shall oh my god! Come back together again soon, Master. Wow, what are the chances of that happening? It's a s Remember, we're talking about the Force here. At this point, Malak himself could drop out of the sky, <laughs> and I wouldn't bat an eye. <laughs> what? Good point. <laughs> uh, 
Candorous believes in the force. Nice, nice. I mean, some people kind of do, some people kind of don't, you know, or they think it's like some sort of magical power or whatever. But like, he's like, <laughs> Malik could drop out of the sky. You won't abandon me, will you, T3? <laughs> uh. I knew the little guy would come through for you. Droid, don't hold grudges. Well, Karth, will you stand with me against Malik? Well, the others seem to trust you. And I don't see any other way that we can stop the Sith. And I suppose that Malik is the real enemy here. I really don't have any other choice, do I? Yeah, you do. You're right, you don't have a choice. I'm in charge here. I'm not revving anymore, Karth. You have to believe that. I want to believe you. You've proven yourself time and time again during our mission, but this is a little much for me to wrap my mind around. How do you think I feel? This must be even more of a shock. Yeah? I don't know how you even keep going. I guess we both just have to find a way to push forward. Don't worry. I won't let my personal feelings get in the way of my assignments or this mission. But don't forget, I've sworn an oath to defend the Republic. As long as this mission stays on course, I'll stick with you. But I won't let you betray the Republic under any circumstances. I, I'll do so my best. I'll do my best, Buggy. We've still got one more star map to uncover if we're going to find that star forge and save Basila. So let's do it before it's too late. Oh, come back. Oh, no. Okay. It booped down to 728. That's part of the problem is the cutscenes don't seem to... They don't seem to be at 1080. The cutscenes are at 720. Or not all of them. Only some of them. Only the space transitions are at 720. Yeah, you missed the end of, the, like, the mission that I didn't realize was only, like, halfway done <laughs> when I last ended. <laughs> Yeah, we just finished, the crew just finished finding out. And and everybody took it well. But I didn't get to hear Johanny's opinion, which is weird. I'm a little weirded out by that. Yes, what's on your mind? Uh, we need to talk about me being Darth Revan. <laughs> if you're ready to talk, then yes. So am I. And? I can't hate you. I tried. I wanted to hold you responsible for all the things you've done for my, for my wife, for Telos, for Dustal, but I can't. Why can't you? I got the revenge I always wanted when Saul died, but it hasn't brought me the peace that I thought of. Yeah. Despite whatever part of Revan is inside you, the, the darkness that must surely be there, it isn't who you are. That's why I can't hate you, why I don't want any more revenge. You don't have to be Revan. You can be so much more. Whatever the Jedi did to you, they gave you that chance. They took away my Whatever brain. To this point, there's going to come a time very soon where you're going to have to make a choice, and there won't be any turning back. And if I make the wrong choice? Well, then I hope I can say. <gasps> oh, it's such an old trope, but like it's one of my faves. I'm not like it depends. It's got to be implemented like right, but I. It does. It's like, oh, why? Thank you. Hey. How can you possibly? Be why didn't you talk to me earlier? You had become the Dark Lord of the Sith. That something was wrong with it. The woman who saved me, who I, I have come to care for, could never go completely to the dark side. Oh, I regret any other harm. Oh, I suppose you can mod the game for cutscenes to make them 1080p. Oh, okay. I don't like rewriting files. It scares me. Oh, of course I'm talking to the whole crew. Uh, I can't, like, I don't know. And, like, technically, Brynn, yeah, I don't know who that Revan was. I'm not her. Technically, Brynn is not Revan, really. Like, she's been given, like, completely different memories and everything. But that doesn't change the fact that, like, this person at one point in time that this body once was did cause harm. So, regret any of the harm uh, I may have caused. But I, I just don't want to, like, make a ton of excuses. And I feel like if, I, if this was me, I would be feeling a lot of guilt, you know. Even though it wasn't, like, me, the person that I think I am now doing it. It was me from, like, that must be so crazy. 
Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, some of the cutscenes run at 1080, which is weird. I think it's just the space ones that have a hard... It's only when I'm transitioning in and out of space that I have issues. Um, but, um, like, cutscenes like that, or cutscenes like the ones with, like, cars or whatever, like, those are fine. Steam made the cutscenes for Coder 2 in 1080p, but not sure. Possibly. I regret any of the harm it may have caused. It is good to know that you have truly changed. It gives me hope. I do not think now that I will fall to the dark side. I only have to look at you and follow by your example. And there is no way... Wow, she... Okay, she's really putting me up on the pedestal. Oh, no. You'll do fine, Johanny. Uh... Oh, wait. You flatter me. Oh, dang. If I could possibly trigger... If I could possibly trigger the romance, would a you flatter me be the, be the one to go? Boop, 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 or you'll do fine, Johanny. Boop, boop, boop. I probably didn't. I, I think it's really hard to trigger her romance without mods, but. I, I am sorry. I did not. What? Realize. I will endeavor to be more considerate in the future. I will <laughs> that was the wrong option. Oh, man. I probably didn't. I didn't save. Yeah. The auto save. Yeah, auto save is not my friend. Oh well. I'll save now, I guess. Yeah, no, I've heard it's just really rare to trigger without mods. 